The Lucifer Effect is a book written by social psychologist Philip Zimbardo. It explores the psychological and social factors that can influence individuals to engage in evil behavior. The book was published in 2007 and quickly gained widespread attention for its insights into the nature of human behavior. The title of the book comes from the biblical story of Lucifer, who was an angel in heaven before he rebelled against God and was cast out. Zimbardo uses this story as a metaphor for how good people can be influenced to engage in evil behavior. He argues that it is not inherent evil within individuals that causes them to engage in evil acts, but rather the circumstances and situational factors that they find themselves in. Zimbardo draws on his own experiences as the creator of the Stanford Prison Experiment, a famous psychological study conducted in the 1970s. The experiment involved randomly assigning college students to either the role of guard or prisoner in a simulated prison environment. The experiment quickly spiraled out of control as the guards became abusive and sadistic towards the prisoners. The study was ultimately halted after only six days due to the extreme levels of cruelty that were being exhibited by the guards. The Stanford Prison Experiment serves as a powerful case study for Zimbardo's arguments in the Lucifer Effect. Zimbardo argues that the situational factors in the experiment, such as the power dynamic between the guards and prisoners and the lack of oversight, led the guards to engage in increasingly abusive behavior. He also notes that the prisoners themselves began to adopt a submissive and helpless attitude, which further reinforced the power dynamic. Zimbardo also draws on a wide range of other examples to support his arguments. He examines the atrocities committed by the Nazis during World War II, the genocide in Rwanda in the 1990s, and the abuse of prisoners at Abu Ghraib prison during the Iraq War. In each case, Zimbardo argues that situational factors played a critical role in the behavior of the individuals involved. The book is divided into three parts. The first part focuses on the Stanford Prison Experiment and how it came to be. Zimbardo provides detailed accounts of the experiment and the events that led to its early termination. He also discusses the implications of the experiment for our understanding of human behavior and the importance of situational factors in shaping our actions. The second part of the book explores the nature of evil and the factors that can lead individuals to engage in evil behavior. Zimbardo argues that evil is not an inherent trait of individuals, but rather a product of situational factors. He explores the role of power, conformity, obedience, and dehumanization in shaping our behavior. The third and final part of the book focuses on how we can prevent evil behavior. Zimbardo argues that understanding the situational factors that can lead to evil behavior is critical to preventing it. He also provides practical advice for individuals and organizations on how to create environments that discourage evil behavior. Overall, The Lucifer Effect is a thought-provoking and insightful book that challenges our assumptions about human behavior. It provides a powerful reminder that we are all capable of both good and evil, and that the situations we find ourselves in can have a profound impact on the choices we make. The book is a must-read for anyone interested in psychology, sociology, or the nature of human behavior.